Us reports that wait lists for mental health services in our state have become a big issue. Many patients waiting months to receive the treatment that they urgently need. Service providers say that the growing need for mental health services doesn't match the number of providers and professionals that are available in Maine. Connor Clement has more on what solutions could help solve this problem. This is an issue that may get worse before it gets better. A provider I spoke with said it's been difficult to service all of her patients, but has some hope that more professionals could join the field soon to help lessen the burden for providers and patients alike. Sweetser, a behavioral health nonprofit, says it has more than 2,000 Mainers in need of care on a wait list right now. That's 2,000 individuals that need mental health care and support today who are not receiving that. It's not just Sweetser. Most providers in the state have some form of a wait list. This is a systemic problem in the system and throughout the state of Maine. Nikki Murray is a mental health clinician working in Limerick. She can't keep up with the number of patients wanting to see her. When folks are feeling like they are in um, distress or in an emergent situation and I just don't have the capacity to help, it's, it's hard. Providers like Murray hope to address the issue by getting more to enter the field's workforce, which providers feel would add some much needed relief. It's a tough job. It's not easy. We need more students to consider this is their field of choice, whether they're studying in school, going to grad school for it. Getting folks into the program and, and helping and offering support to other people in the community, I think, is huge. We, we all need it so, so much. If you or someone you know is interested in pursuing a career in mental health services, or maybe you're already a provider thinking about opening your own practice, you can find more information at sweetser.org slash affiliate network. With Maine's total coverage, I'm Connor Clement.